The Kristen Smart murder trial resumed today following a nearly week-long break. Forensic DNA analyst Angela Butler was back in the stand and testified about a package she received from Slow County Sheriff's Detective Clint Cole in March of 2021. The package contained what Butler described as, quote, damp sandy soil. She says while inspecting the package, there were some very unusual pieces of soil in a variety of colors. Butler described the test she did on some of the soil samples to test for blood and said all six samples came back with weak positive results for the test of blood. And after the court was shown various photos to help explain how the tests work, Prosecutor Christopher Pavrell asked what the significance of the results were to Butler and she replied, quote, as far as the conclusions I can draw, I have confirmed the presence of human blood in these samples. Butler added, however, that she was unable to extract any DNA from the samples, telling the court that while DNA lasts decades under pristine conditions, if not stored correctly, you may not get any results. Butler says there were a total of 13 positive blood samples from soil samples she received in March and April of 2021. And if, if you have missed any part of the trial, you can get caught up on it when you scan this QR code that, that will take you to the Kristen Smart case section of our website, which has our full coverage of the investigation and the trial.